Yo, what's up, guys? This is B Boy Seven Hundred Seven Mods, and today this is part three of how to edit Whitewater V Five. So, I am a little mad today because my back is killing me right now, and I lost my PC tutorial. So I just had to get a new Whitewater patch with nothing on it. So I just didn't feel like editing it at all because what we did was a lot of work to edit so I'm just gonna start off with this it, it's just how to edit a shader for a white water v5 so the first thing I'm gonna want you to do is type control F and then type shader go to next now when you hit shader it should bring you to MP challenge completed it should bring you there and then what you're gonna wanna do when you get here you're gonna wanna go down a little bit and then you're gonna find UI underscore camo skin underscore blue underscore tiger now what you're gonna do is change the blue part whoops only sucky thing about having a laptop uh, change the blue to red then you're gonna hit that again then you're gonna wanna go down you're gonna find blue again you're gonna type red then you're gonna save it open up MW2 and I'll show you what I did So now, there's a red shader. Alright, next shader right here. Here's another shader that you can do. Um, it's going to be the 10th Prestige Emblem. You guys probably know what it is already. Let's see if I can just... You can find the 10th Prestige Emblem like three spots above, um, yeah, three spots above the UI camo. So now you're just going to want to save it and just start up the game again. And I'll show you. No, I messed up. Messed up. Totally messed up. So. Here's the thing, guys. When you're doing the prestige emblems and stuff, it's going to look all weird and stuff like that. Uh, I'll just use this as an example. But, alright, when you first open up the menu, if you didn't change anything, it's going to look all crappy like that. So, the thing you're going to want to do is, let me just exit out of the game first. Go to this part. See prestige, blah blah blah. See where it says three five five. Change that to a one. Change the eight to a two. Then you're gonna go up a little more. Change that to a one. Change that to a two. Then you're gonna save it. Then it'll look okay. Let me start it now. Alright, now, there you go. And in the next video I'll make, depends if it's not that late already. Yeah, right now I can do it. It's only four minutes into the video. Um, I'll show you how to do a checkered background if you don't know how to do it. So, the first thing you're going to want to do is 
go to your card icon underscore prestige 10 let's change that to a 1 and go to the top and change this to a 1 then let me go down a little bit more change that back to a 3 change that to a 8 3 8 save then start up the game I wish the game would load faster now you probably um, used Felipe hacks version 9.5 before probably haven't if you have um or you know you probably haven't seen this background but my friend put out a, uh, my friend edited of uh, loop a hacks 9.5 and he put a uh, multi patch whatever multi blah 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 I don't know <laughs> but he had this so every time you go to a different sub menu like to player one and player two it would have like a different um, shader color I have no clue how he did that but it was really cool um but yeah that's how you put that kind of shader on there so I hope you like the video guys and thank you for watching and this is um part three of how to edit whitewater v5 shaders so hope you guys like all right please rate comment subscribe i'm super close 200 subscribers um like i said in my previous video i'll give out some patches if you um subscribe or if i get 100 subscribers a few patches and i will make a few patches if you guys want me to um oh yeah so hope you guys like it like i said before please rate comment subscribe all right later